What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Brian Garcia Torado here. Uh, today we're here in Kyle, Texas, which isn't too far from where I live, but I wanted to take the time and introduce you guys to one of my friends, longtime supporter of Torado Racing from the very beginning. Uh, she runs her own business and she's been in the car scene for a long time. So I want to show you guys her car and talk about her business. So let's check it out. What's up fam? Hey, Jordan Leon Vargas here. What's up? So uh, I told the viewers a little bit about you already. I told them that you've been in the car scene and you've got your own business. You want to tell them what your business is about? Yeah, Sinister Designs. Uh, anything custom from shirts, lanyards, hoodies, decals from roll calls, banners, you name it, I can do it. And as you can see, she's wearing her lanyard and her t-shirt. Yeah. So she's made some stuff for me before. You might have seen my picture of my car on uh, JBA's uh, Instagram, the giant JBA decal she made for me. So she's been great. She's uh, I'll hit her up late at night and say, hey, I need this made, and she always gets it done. I got the hookup. Anything you need, I got you. What's the Instagram handle that we can find you at? The Instagram handle is sinister underscore designs 05. Okay, very cool. And I know you just started your own YouTube uh, channel. Yes. So uh, what channel is that? That one's Sinister Babe. Just Sinister Babe. Okay, so you, you're going to be covering uh, car content as well as uh, stuff you're going to be doing to your car, right? Yes, and just tons of vlogs, going to car meets, and doing all kinds of things. Very cool. So tell them what your car is. It is an 05 V6 Mustang. So looking at the outside of your car here, it looks very different from a stock V6 Mustang. You want to tell us about all these goodies right here? We got the true fiber, carbon fiber hood. Beautiful. I love it. And then we've got the California Dream bumper paired with a Pony Delete uh, grill with fog lights. So it kind of gives it that GT look. And then I've tinted my headlights just to make it look a little bit more aggressive because that's what I was going for is super aggressive. And this true, this carbon fiber hood looks like the GT500, like Super Snake hood almost, is it? Yeah, it's similar to that. It's got a little bit similarities and different right here. It's kind of cut down here. So we talked about the headlights and your front grill. Uh, what about your taillights? My taillights, I have the Gen 5 taillights currently on the car. I did have the Raxium Vector taillights working on getting those fixed because those look way more aggressive than the Gen 5s. Cool. So talked about the outside uh, do you have anything done to the engine do you have anything um, performance wise uh, just some few minor bolt-ons I've got the air aid cold air intake JLT catch can and that's really about it not too too much uh, performance wise yet I'm looking to get a tune and some headers in and a Mishimoto inter uh, radiator okay very cool I know you're uh, team Mishimoto as am I oh, yeah. so uh, so I noticed you got uh, some different wheels on there too they're not the stock v6 wheels what no, wheels are those got the American muscle charcoal magnetic style wheels they kind of mimic the s550 wheel style that you see on the I think this is the premium packs that they have for the 50s so I kind of wanted something a little bit different for the 05 just to kind of upgrade it and make it look a little more modern on top of that I have the Yokohama s drive tires on there just to give it a little bit more aggressive look and my wheels are 20s so 20 by 9 10 i have 20 by 8.5s in the front and 20 by 10s in the back for a staggered look just to give it that more aggressive feel very cool very cool so we know what you've done to the car what are your future plans with the car future plans with the car is to start doing the autocross getting into more track days and starting to you know work on horsepower a little bit more. We need a tune, um, a few other bolt-ons to kind of make it wake up a little bit, uh, give it a little bit more push for the V6. So um, so you're telling me that it's not going to be a pavement princess, it's not a parking lot pimp. You're going to race this car. Yes, definitely plan on doing more action with it than it just being a show car and just, you know, pretty and sitting there in the parking lot. <laughs> That's the two, true Toronto racing spirit right there. That's what I like to hear. Yeah, let's go. Well, guys, there you have it. Uh, this is my friend Jordan Leal Vargas, a huge supporter of Toronto Racing. Jordan, thank you so much for supporting me and helping me out as much as you have. Always. No thank you for having me. It's of been course. a pleasure. You're so, a thank you friend. so much. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video and you check out uh, Sinister Design 05s and you check out her build because she's going to keep building it up. I mean, look, look how mean it looks right there in this picture. 
And with that said, you know, I want to finish this video off by talking about like that's the spirit of like Toronto racing. That's what we're about is building community, making friends and supporting one another. You know, it might not be a GT500 or a GT350, but it's all about the build. She's taking her car, a V6, and making it to what it is right now and making it something even better. And you know, that's something that anybody can look at and be inspired by. Taking something small, making it bigger, making it faster. So with that being said, guys, whatever it is you want to build, whatever it is you want to do, just go out there and do it. So thanks for watching, guys. Until next time, peace out.